everybody welcome back to my channel thank you for clicking on today's video so as you can tell from the title I'm gonna be filming a what I got for my 21st birthday video <sighs> can you hear that my chest is like rattling my cough and cold is a bit better than it was but I am still like very bunged up and I don't sound particularly well so apologies for that I do still have a cold um but anyway I'm filming today's video and we're gonna get on with it so yeah like I said I'm filming a 21st birthday haul video I've filmed these types of videos for the past couple of years I think I did one on my 18th 19th 20th and now I'm filming my 21st so I hope you enjoy it quick disclaimer as always at the beginning of these types of videos I'm not trying to brag about the presents I got, I'm not trying to show off, I just purely like these videos myself, I enjoy watching them, they're very popular on YouTube and I know people like to be nosy and see what other people got for their birthdays so I thought I would film this video as I always do every year. So yeah, nevertheless, let's get on with the video. So I've got all of the little presents that I'm going to be showing you in this gift bag here and I'm just going to pull them out at random and tell you guys what I got I'm not going to do it in any particular order and I'm not going to like go and in, into detail and tell you who got me what because you don't need to know that and that's not what you're here to watch the video for so I'm just going to pull stuff out of here and show you guys so the first thing I've got is my beautiful Estee Lauder bronze goddess this is my all-time favorite perfume in the entire world and it's so hard to get your hands on um and my mum knows that it's really difficult to get hold of you can only really get it during the summer months they only bring it out once a year and then when it gets to winter they stop selling it so managed to get one of these which is just amazing and it's such a big bottle so hopefully this will last me until next summer what next Next up I have got this really cute little notebook that's from Urban Outfitters. I actually knew I was getting this, I picked this out and gave it to my mum to give to me for my birthday because it was really cute and I wanted it. Um, so yeah, like I said, it's from Urban Outfitters. It's a daily journal and it's just a white little journal with little boobs all over it and I think it's really cute. Um, so yeah, inside you've just got a little like... I don't even know what they're called, like timetables, <laughs> I don't know, like little sections to put notes and to-do lists and you write the day and stuff at the top of the page, so I'm going to start using that, very exciting. Next up I have got a skincare product from Pixi, which I've been using ever since I got and it's honestly incredible. So this is the Pixi Rose Caviar Essence, which I had never heard of before, but it looks like this. It's in a really cute packaging. It's in a cute little pink tube, and basically it's got like rose petals inside it, and you just put a tiny little bit on to the tips of your fingers, rub it in, and then kind of like press it into your skin like you would with a serum, and it just really hydrates your skin. It's amazing. I've been loving using it. It makes my skin feel gorgeous afterwards, and yeah, it's a really, really lovely product. I would recommend checking that out if you're into skincare stuff. Um, I did also get something else from Pixi. It's just the Rose Tonic. It says Rose and Elderflower Nourishing Toner, which is really, really nice. Again, I've been using this every day since literally cannot smell anything right now but I know it smells nice um again just really nice and kind on like gentle skin um and yeah it's great I've been using it ever since so check those out if you're into your skincare stuff next I have got a phone case this is a skinny dip phone case and it says but first cocktails which is so cute so I need to put this one onto my phone I haven't got round to it yet um also from skinny dip I've got these two little pens uh they're really cute they're rose gold kind of posh looking pens uh, one of them's glittery and the other one says something on it but it's very rude so I'm not going to read it out loud if you're interested you can go and find these pens yourself and read it because I'm not gonna use that word on my channel um okay next up is a little makeup sponge also from skinny dip which is really cute I didn't know skinny dip did like beauty products but yeah it's like a little purple beauty blender which I need to start using because my beauty blender is disgusting like it needs a wash majorly um, another skincare product are these, which are by the brand Amy, which I haven't heard of before, and it says they are brightening sheet masks, which I'm very excited about. There's three in this pack, and I love sheet masks. I think they're so exciting to use and just really fun, and they make your skin feel amazing. I think I'm going to have a bath tonight because I haven't had a bath in ages, so I'm going to have a nice pampy evening and maybe use one of those. 
Um, I have then got a product from The Body Shop, which is one of my all-time favourites, which I haven't bought in so long. I don't ever use Body Shop products anymore because if you guys have been around on my channel for a while, you might know that I used to work at The Body Shop when I was... I think I was 16, it was my first ever job, I loved it, but I haven't really gone back in there since because I never used to want to go back in the one where I worked because it, I don't know, you know when you just avoid places that you've previously worked, it was kind of one of those situations, so I never really ended up trying any of the like the newer body shop products, but I used to love all of the things in this range which is the Shea range or Shea, Shea, however you pronounce it, it's basically just a really nice neutral scent, yep again cannot smell it at all but I know it smells nice um, and this is just the shower cream and then I've also got the matching shower no not shower the matching body butter which I used to love I honestly oh it's fresh it hasn't been touched yet how satisfying is this gonna be oh my god so good so good yeah I used to love this range and I also used to love the body butters they're really good to use if you fake tan because they're not very scented so if you use the Shea one before you fake tan you get a good tan at the end of it but yeah I absolutely love the body shop stuff and I haven't had it in ages so I'm really excited to have these again in my life um what else have we got I've got a little makeup bag which is really cute it's from Oliver Bonus or however you pronounce it I just don't know um, and it's really cute it's like a little grey makeup bag with gold foiling on it and then you open it up and it kind of has like a hard a hard bit inside it like a bit of wire so it sort of stays open it's got cute little compartments in it so I'm definitely going to use this soon when I go away next I'm actually going up to Oxford on what day am I going uh, Wednesday so a couple of days after you watch this video I'm going up Oh no, this video is for the following Sunday. Okay, by the time you watch this, I will have already have gone to Oxford. But right now, <laughs> I haven't been. Um, but I'm going up to Oxford next week. I'm going to see Alex, because that is where he is originally from. So I'm going to stay at his house for a couple of days. And he's got a gig whilst I'm up there. So I'm going to go to his gig. So I'll probably pack my makeup in this. Get some use out of it. That was, that was my little story. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, another product from the body shop is their Himalayan charcoal purifying glow mask which sounds very exciting again I can't smell it so I'm not even going to bother pretending to um, but it's just a I think it's a black yeah it's kind of like a grey black charcoal looking mask really exciting might end up using that one tonight instead actually because my skin's a bit spotty I've got a massive spot right on my cheek and it's really gross um, but yeah again love, love skincare from the body shop it's always really really good um, right, I'm going to save that one till last. I've got a big bar of Bourneville chocolate, which it's just great. I love chocolate and Bourneville chocolate's delicious. I always try and eat it because it's got like extra iron and stuff in. It's just a bit better for you than normal chocolate. Um, I've also got a little lip balm, which is just a little cute present from the body shop. It's just a little like tinted, rosy coloured lip balm. I have no idea what it smells like because I can't smell it. Uh, here we go. Strawberry and pomegranate. There we go. Uh, next, I have got some little shoes, which my mum just said were like a little jokey present, but I love like sliders like this, especially fluffy ones. I bought a pair um, before I started uni to wear around the flat, and they're just really like destroyed after wearing them around the flat for like basically a year. So I've got a new pair, and they're just black fluffy ones. I think these are from Primark. Yeah, they're from Primark. Size three, just little black fluffy sliders, which I probably am just going to use as slippers, but I love them a lot. Um, I've got a couple of little bits left to show you and then a very exciting one which I'm saving till the end because I mean like that. Uh, I've got a new look gift voucher um, and I have then got a few little bits of jewellery which are really sweet. So I got this cute little pair of earrings from Claire's which I have actually already got. I've got the little star like ear climber in this ear but I can never have too many earrings because I always lose them and break them so they're really cute so I've got them as a backup and then I've got this cute little pair of moon earrings which are also from Claire's I did used to have these but I lost them so I'm now happy to have a new pair um, and then I've got a spare little nose ring because again these always fall out and get broken and lost so I've now got a nice new spare one um, and then this is very very sweet so this is a necklace from the company called Sophie Jones Jewellery. I think my mum got this off of notonthehighstreet.com um, and it comes in a cute little box and then you open it up 
and inside is this gorgeous necklace and it says happy 21st birthday emily a ring to celebrate each decade and a little ring to signify your 21st year so it's basically this really sweet silver necklace which i love i love anything silver like silver jewelry is just my favorite it's a gorgeous length you obviously you can't really see it but it's just got three little hoops on it so two big hoops for each decade that I've been alive and then a tiny little silver hoop in the middle to signify my 21st year which I just think is so cute and it's so nice to have a present like that that I can just keep and always remember having it for my 21st so I've got that which is so gorgeous and then for my very exciting last present which I was debating showing because I thought I'm just going to get people commenting and giving their opinion on this but you know what, I don't care what people think and they can think what they want. I'm not showing off in this video like I've said and at the end of the day it's my 21st birthday and if my parents want to buy me something then who are you to judge me? Um, but anyway, this is the very exciting present. So I opened this Gucci bag and very, very exciting moment. I knew I was getting it, obviously I like said to my parents... Uh, yeah I don't know why I'm justifying myself I don't need to justify myself this is what I got it is a gorgeous gorgeous Gucci purse and it came in this little box here and a little bag to keep it nice and clean it's got it's actually got my money in it because I've been using it obviously um but here it is I will try and leave a link down below to this purse if you guys want to know specifically which Gucci purse it is but it's just got gorgeous little Gucci logo on the front and then it's sort of stitched into the print of the purse at the back as well and then you open it up and you've got room for your cards and then a little sort of change section there and then a little bit of room for notes as well and um, I did originally want the Gucci card holder just like the small little card holder but I decided that it was kind of a bit impractical and it's a lot easier and better to have a purse so that I can put like coins and stuff in it so yeah I went for this one in the end and I am absolutely in love with it so I know I'm super super grateful and I'm very very lucky to get this for my birthday um but yeah I'm going to cherish this forever and try and keep it in perfect condition even though I'm going to use it like every day obviously um it's got all of my money and stuff in it already but yeah that is the most exciting present ever and that's why I kept it till the end to show you guys but I'm going to pop that one back now so that was that so I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video please do give it a thumbs up down below if you enjoyed it and click subscribe if you haven't already I'm very very lucky and I'm so grateful for everything I got for my birthday I didn't share everything with you guys I just showed kind of bits that I feel like people will be most interested in um, but yeah thank you to all my friends and family who got me presents they were so lovely and yeah very very grateful I had the best holiday um, if you guys didn't know I went on holiday for my birthday that is the previous video that has gone up on this channel so I filmed um, a vlog whilst I was out in Marbella with my sister over my 21st birthday so if you haven't seen that go and check it out it's a nice half an hour long video so grab yourself a cup of tea some snacks and go and watch that Marbella vlog but yeah thank you for watching this video guys and I'll see you next week with another one goodbye <laughs>